there is a unity in in the way that we are we want love and to be loved and to find purpose and to feel like we're we're useful in some ways Well, the question I would have is, what does flyleaf mean? Because it meant something to me before. And 11 years ago was like a a lifetime ago. The faith aspect of our music was foundational for me personally. Um, I would not have done music if it had not been for for my journey with faith. And a lot of the fans became fans from that place of connecting over the faith part of what we do. So that's why I think it's good to talk about those things. I know Samir's talked about some of that journey as well. I found like it's, it's just, it, for me, it was just like a, it was such a bigger thing than, than, than putting it down into one faith or saying that it's just this one set of vocabulary that describes this enormous world and how we find meaning in it. And I think for me, that was a difficult thing to work through with Samir. You know, when, when you travel the world and you see, you know, how, you know, these other people are, are finding meaning and purpose, you know, and they're using, you know, different words, but it kind of means the same thing. You know, you, you realize that it's something so much bigger, you know? We're using different words, and you said that just now. The source of that, I still think is, you know, is the personal God that became flesh in Jesus Christ. And I think that the fact that you um, don't want to limit your words to that um, as defining it is, is the place that you're at to bring peace and freedom, I think, to your heart, right? I hope so, you know, I, I, I don't know, and, and um, I feel like I'm learning and growing and changing every day, you know, and, and so like I, you know, where I am now may not be where I, where I am, you know, it, 10 years from now. Right. You know. I think you know, I, I, when we first started, it was, you know, we are writing music um, to save the world in some ways. You know, like we, we had this big message. We worked really hard and wrote a bunch of songs and toured around and, and met everyone we could to to spread this message of of hope and love and um, and I think it's still there. <laughs> That's enough now, dry your tears. It's better than the letters. Kind of seeing this this family from long ago again, it's it's very surreal. It's sort of like we were in a, a time capsule like a Twilight Zone episode or something. I I love how every member has progressed and grown up even more, and uh, every member of Flyleaf is even more conscientious and aware of 
the gift we have to play with each other. And, and that, that has been really um, encouraging and healing and, and a special thing, you know, that I, I didn't think would happen again. So. I mean, it feels amazing to play together again. No matter how small the room is, we started in someone's living room or in the garage that we had out by the lake. It's nice to be able to spend time hanging out too, just seeing where everybody's at with their families and lives and a lot of time's passed, so a lot to catch up on. You know, it's a band that I grew up in. Uh, I was 15 when I joined the band, and so uh, a lot of my formative years were being a part of the band. Uh, a lot of that passion was not only for music, but also you know, we brought a message of hope in all the songs and uh, just really conveyed that through um, you know, how we lived and how we played. And that really affected you know, me and, uh, and I think a lot of our fans and gotten you know, multiple, multiple messages over the years of just how a certain song has impacted someone in a certain season. And just knowing that you know, I was a part of that for so long is uh, just really awesome. I'm grateful for uh, this, this family, you know. Um, I'm really uh, flabbergasted that it's actually happening. I didn't think that, that, that it would, so it's really cool that, 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 that it is and that, you know, we're all supporting each other, you know, in, in, our, new, in our new lives and, and where we are. It's really cool, and I'm, I'm really happy that you know, a lot of people that didn't get a chance to say, you know, goodbye to the band a number of weeks, you know, kind of stopped, <laughs> will ha have a chance to see us again. If you can find that common ground and stay, which is what we're doing right now, almost kind of like in Flyleaf, where we're finding common ground to stand on stage together and to have dinner together and have life together and and sing each other's songs. Like you're, you're playing songs I wrote, I'm singing lyrics you wrote. I'm finding common ground in those things. And I, and I find... Me too. Yeah, so here we are trying to do that. And I think that's the message I want to make sure people come away with, is that I honor where you are on your journey and I still have to hang on to where God has me on my journey. I honor you where you are on your journey. Everybody has something to contribute to Flyleaf. That's what Flyleaf was when we started, was a combination of everybody's heart and everybody's history and everybody's musical influence and everybody's, you know, journey. And it became what it was.